Hello, in this video, I want to show you how to make graphic designs with your smartphone. If you have always wanted to learn how to make beautiful, stunning graphic designs, um, this tutorial will really help you because I'm going to be showing you step by step, you know, how to make beautiful graphic designs using only your smartphone. Now, in this tutorial, we'll be using an application called Pixel App. Now, Pixel App is quite popular among Android users and even iPhone users, especially those who make use of their phones to make, you know, graphic designs. This is a very popular application and it's available on Play Store for free. You can get it. It's completely free. No in-app purchases, no premium plan. It's absolutely free. That's why I love it. So you can get it for free on Google Play Store. Now, let me show you some of the things I've actually designed, you know, using my phone. Um so check this out um here are thumbnails i designed you know using my smartphone check this out i designed this thumbnail using a uh, pixel app on my smartphone you understand so so basically the app has a lot of potentials here are other things i've been able to design using pixel app you can see how beautiful these designs are these are professional designs I used my smartphone, you know, to make, and it was crazy. It was awesome. Check this out. I used this. I used my smartphone to make this, and you can see how awesome this is. So, basically, I want to show you how you too, you know, can make designs with your smartphone on this Pixel app. Um, so, quickly, let's get started. Um, what you want to do is open your application, and as you can see, that's a very simple interface. A very simple interface you don't need to struggle or to be confused about anything um, now before I proceed with this tutorial I want you to do something for me real quick I want you to hit the subscribe button you know this tutorial has a lot of value and the only way you can say thank you and support this channel is by subscribing trust me is the least you could do just hit the subscribe button and I really appreciate the support I see subscribing as a real really a really good support for me because this channel is still very very small and you know i see that as a support so make sure you subscribe and make sure you like this video now i haven't said that i think i can proceed with the tutorial so right now i want to make a design using this application and um, first of all i'll start with changing the background so to change my background i'll come to this icon below at the base of this app right here i'll click it just watch my cursor, watch my finger and where I'm clicking so you don't, you know, so you're not mistaken or you don't get confused. So I'll click on color and then I'll select any color I want. But sometimes the color you want won't be here or most times you can't even find your preferred color here. So you click on this plus sign and here you can modify your color by dragging this, um, what, what do I call this by dragging it basically around the charts to find your preferred color so uh, let me see I'm going to use um, this let me see I'll use green yeah but now there's something I want to do um, I don't want to use this plain green I want to make something really beautiful with my green color so just watch me I'll click on gradient and I'll click on the plus sign I'm going to click right here, then I'll click on this and I'll put green and I'll click on this and I'll put green as well. So as you can see, um, it looks better than the previous color so basically now we have created our background quickly what we want to do now is insert a picture so i'm going to click on the plus sign click on gallery gallery then i'll insert my picture so i'm going to insert i'm um, sorry Um, I'm trying to look for the 
picture the image i want to use okay so um i would use uh let me see i would use this so yeah but i want to reduce the color i want to remove the color i prefer it this way black and white and yeah i'm gonna add some shadow behind and then i'll add um, um stroke yeah i think we're good so right now i want to add my text graphic designer i'm going to align my text and then i'll change the font to this i prefer using this particular font and i'll increase it and I'll adjust it, the line in between the text. Okay. Um. So I think we're cool here. I'm just gonna leave it like this, this way. Yeah, so I'm going to add a little text. Um, okay, I'm just going to do something. I'm just going to add some shadow to the text as well. So it can pop out, you know. Adding text to your shadow, adding shadow to your text. You can see the difference. Makes it clearer. So I'm going to add something else. Um, I'm going to add this. Okay, first of all, I'll add my text. There's something else I want to put. So I'll say, hire a competent So I'll leave it like this. I'm going to increase the spacing. Increase the spacing. Yeah, I think we're cool like this. And um, I want to increase, change the font to this. This. Um, no. So if I'm making my fonts like uh, this, okay. So now I'm going to, I want to put this shape right here behind my text you know i'm trying to create something uh, i hope would be cool just watch me so i'm going to reduce the size to I think this is okay and i'll position it right here oh yeah Okay, then I'll bring, uh, I'm going to add stroke, black stroke to it. Then I'll add shadow. Yeah, so then I'm going to change the color of my text to green. So you can see this. So basically our design is. Yeah, so you can see how good this is already looking. And I'm loving it already. So basically we're almost done with the design. I want to just create something simple, not much. 
So I'm just gonna add this right here. Okay, um, okay, so yeah, basically, this is it. So, yeah, you can see how this looks already. Um, I might still want to add like this something else. Um, now change the font. Yeah, then of course I'll, I'll reduce the size. Yeah, so you can see how this looks. Basically, our design is nice and like it's just really cool. And um, basically, if you have any questions, you can ask me in the comment section. Talk to me, I'll respond to you as soon as I can. So basically, I'll leave our design this way. And if you want to learn more on Pixel Lab, make sure you are subscribed because I'll be creating a lot of tutorials on how to make graphic designs, you know, with your smartphone on Pixel Lab. So I'm going to save our design first as a project. And then I'll save it as an image. Yeah. 